Yo, yo, it's Yerk, and today I want to talk about the player counter and how easy it is now to make placement points in Fortnite Creative. So, this new player counter makes placement points so much easier. There's no confusing settings. It's really intuitive, and you guys will be able to pick it up really fast. So, we're going to go ahead and just set it up. So, the first thing we're going to need is going to be, of course, a player counter. And for this first one, we're going to set up the winning points. So, you can set it to whatever you want, but you're just going to open up the settings here. You're going to set target player count to 1. And you want to make sure that you have the compare player count set to equal to. Then we're just going to go back in here and we're going to set the transmit for on compare result change to all counted players. This way, everyone who's alive is going to get counted and it will send a signal for them. So now for the info panel, I just, w I just went ahead and set this to one because this is going to be our number one placement point. And the color doesn't matter. You can make it whatever you want. But then we're going to set transmit for all counted players when receiving from channel one. And then we're also going to set when count succeeds transmit on channel one. Okay, so now we're going to need to pull out a score manager device. If we go ahead and pull out the score manager device, we can open it up and then we can just pick what do we want the score to be for the number one spot. So if you win, how many points are you getting? I went ahead and just did 10 and then we're just going to say activate when receiving from channel one. So now this is already our victory point right here, but now we need to end the game. So we're going to pull out a round settings device. So we pull out our round settings device and we are just going to set end round when receiving from channel four. Now, if you're going to use more placement points than just first, third, and fifth, then you're going to want to set this to like channel five or just whatever channel you don't use. But I set it here to four. And then after that, we're going to need a trigger. Pull out your trigger and all we're going to do is set a delay of like three seconds. Then we're going to set trigger when receiving from channel one and when triggered transmit on channel four. This way, when this triggers and says there's one player alive, it will then delay. So it gives them long enough to get the points. And then the round will end because it's going to transmit on the channel four. So now it's as easy as now we're just going to copy our first one, paste it down. And now all we're going to change is we're going to set the target player count to three players. Change the info panel icon to three players or three. Then we're just going to set when count succeeds transmit on channel two. Then. We're going to copy our score manager over, open it up. And now we're going to say, how many points do we want to give top three? I went ahead with five and we're just going to set activate on channel two. Okay, perfect. I think you guys are getting the gist here, but we're going to go ahead and copy it again. And now we're going to do top five. So open up the settings. We're just going to change the target player count from three to five. Then we're going to change the info panel icon to five. And when count succeeds, transmit on channel three. Now we're going to do the same thing again. Copy our score manager. How many points do we want to give top three or top five? Uh, I said three points and we're going to set activate when receiving from channel three. Now you could go on again and set this to, uh, you could go on again and then set this to top 10 and, uh, so you could go on again and set this to top 10 and then you do this for four, but then you would need to set this all up to like channel five, but I'm not doing that for this example. And because I don't have all these players, uh, enough players in here with me, I'm going to go ahead and just turn on compare it game start. This will show you guys that I do get the points, but here now, but as you guys can see, once the game starts, we are going to have 10 points because it thinks we won. And now the game is about to end. Bam, just like that easiest placement point system ever. All thanks to the new player counter device. If you guys enjoyed this video, do me a favor, drop a like, hit subscribe, do whatever you want to do and all that good stuff. If you want to support me, you can use code YerkYT in the item shop. But that is all I have for this one. Thank you all so much for watching. And as always, stay up.